Hi everybody, thank you so much for uh, popping by and having a look at this uh, Instagram video. So uh, this is going back to look at the hair care edit and how we left off last year. Uh, there's a break over Christmas, there's been a break the first work, working lockdown. I have to be really honest, I didn't you know, know, even know whether I was going to continue with them, but I had so many messages this week asking when they were coming back and people that I've spoke to saying we'd love to see them again that I thought... Let's start the new year with uh, with a with a biggie. So today we're going to look at Kara Stars's top five products. Why I believe they're the top five, and who are they for, and what exactly are they going to do? So everybody, every brand, whatever brand it is in the world, will have the biggest selling products, and, and a lot of them it's because that's what the main population, and sometimes it's because that's what we understand. Uh, but today I really want to kind of look at why they are the top and why. Um, why you love them, why your customers love them, and why um, why we kind of all need them in our lives and in our businesses. So the first one is is part of the reflection ring. It's in Ban Chromatic. So Ban Chromatic, um, we do two formulations. We do um, a gentle formulation, and then we do the original band. The, the difference is the gentle formulation is. Um, it is more sulfate free, so there's less sulfates within it. But the whole range is really about capturing that perfect colour for the 40 days, so for six weeks. The client it's for, I would say, has got um has got a light amount of colour. So there could be um there could be a semi-permanent, it could be a demi-permanent, there could be a permanent colour, maybe using a six vol or less, so more of a tint than um than high lift colours. Uh, and it's really about capturing that molecule. So the, the technology is system, system capture advanced. So the, why it's there is that, that we have three main enemies of colour. I always like to think of them as the three C's. So you've got um, copper, calcium and chlorine. So and, and we can't help what's in our water supply. There's nothing we can do unless you want to get a really expensive water filter um, fitted to your, to your pipes at home. This does it for you. The three main elements of colour, like I said, is, is copper minerals. So sometimes if you live in the country, you might have a um, private water supply. They, they will often have very lots and lots of minerals in the water. A lot of modern houses actually have copper piping. Um, if you think about copper, think always think of the easiest way to explain it is think of a wet 2P, a, a, a 2P that's got damp and it goes that kind of green metallic kind of colour. Um, that's really what it's doing to because it flattens the colour. It really takes away that shine. Calcium is hard water. So if you live in a hard water area, so you go to your kettle and there's little bits of scale in the kettle, that's a hard water area. If you think about it, it's invisible to the naked eye, but those tiny little particles, as you cleanse the hair, it's almost like you're kind of buffing off that top layer. So you're buffing on that top layer, you, you know, it's, it's taking away that natural kind of shine away from the colour. And it's, it's like the world's mildest exfoliant, but it's still there and there's not a lot you can do about it. Um, and then we also have chlorine. Chlorine got added to the water supply in the UK probably about, it's about 15, 20 years ago. And actually, sometimes if you've been away on holiday and you suddenly put your taps on, you kind of sometimes smell it. I used to smell it a lot in hotels when I was in hotels and I was staying away. Uh, back in the day when we all stayed away. Um, and, and chlorine, we know it's a mild bleach. Obviously, in our water supply, it is only there really to keep the water really, really clear and to keep it clean. It's not there to do anything like it would do in a swimming pool and it's nowhere near as strong. But if you think about your hair, your delicate coloured hair, um, anything that can degradate that colour is an issue. And if you're thinking of those three things, and sometimes we have all three, You've got that, you know, that calcium gently exfoliating. You've now got a really mild, mild bleach there on the colour as well, um, because that's really what chlorine is. It starts to massively take away that colour, that shine, that vibrancy, that intensity. So it's beautiful on um, on really glossy colours. Um, shine, you know, you and you really, really want to kind of maximise that, maximise the reflection because that's what it's going to do, and to really kind of, you know ultimately protect um, that colour. We also have a bit of vitamin E in there as well. So vitamin E works against external aggressors, and it protects against what's happening on the outside. Um, you've also got rice bran oil. So rice bran oil there is to kind of perfect the shine. Rice bran oil is completely weightless, so it doesn't create any weight in there. It's really about 
giving that hair that baba boom and that shine. And if you think about how many colour clients we do uh, every day in the salon, it's no wonder this is number five within the Kerastars, uh, within the Kerastars family and ranges. An incredible product, but it's really good to know why it's so good at what it does. It saves us all having to get a water purification system in our salons, in our homes, uh, and it kind of does the does the job for you. Then we come to, uh, to band session number one. So band session number one has been um, around for many, many years. Um, and New to TV is, is, you know, it was, it's like the grand arm of Kerastars. I started hairdressing 35 years ago. And um, mainly back then, it was new to tube, new to tube, new to tube, and that was the range. And it was a huge range then, but there was a lot of new to tube products. And then obviously, it was, as we've advanced, we've created all these new families, which you see all the time, which is amazing. But new to tube will never, ever stop being one of our top families because the, the results are phenomenal. The majority of people do have some form of dryness through their hair. Also in the UK, we really like a lightweight product. And that's kind of where Nutritive sits. It's a really, you know, yeah, we're band session number one. It's a really light, uh, light, light cleanse. It's going to help to treat those dry ends. And when we say dry ends, we mean your hair feels quite natural. Um, but so towards the end, it just feels a bit dry. It feels a bit tuggy. Um, if you get any knots and tangles, that's where it will be. And that's really how it treats it. The technology is called Iris Rizzo. So iris rhizome is, is the, all the nutritive properties taken from the iris flower. But it's not taken from the petal, it's not taken from the oil, it's taken from the iris bulb. So this bulb is quite amazing. The iris flower is one of the only flowers that will flower several times a year. The flower comes, disappears and then flowers again. It will also flower in really adverse conditions. So it, you know, even you know, on, on a really hot summer's day, and um, it might flower again in the middle of January, you've got snow on the ground. It has this amazing ability to hold its hold and protect itself in the root um, and send the nutrients to flowers. So it flowers for a very long time and you get them several times a year. Um, I don't know how many of you are going to get this year. I've recently planted all the iris bulbs in a new house where I moved to. But in the last house, some, some years it felt like you only had months when it didn't flower. It seemed to constantly, constantly flower. And that's an amazing ability of the iris rhizome, the iris root, being able to kind of send that nutritive properties where you need it. And that's exactly what it does on the hair. It's able to keep your hair soft and hydrated and it stops that dryness coming back. We found that a lot of people that had dry hair would, would treat it, would cleanse it and then find literally 24 hours later the hair starts to feel dry again. This will keep your hair softer for longer. It will start saying softer between, between cleanses and obviously the more you use it the more it's able to treat your hair and stop that dryness coming back altogether, which is just amazing. Because obviously with dryness, if you don't treat it, it could start to get weak um, and, and start to get actually a little bit of damage as well. We need to make sure we keep that tight, that, that dryness hydrated so we don't start getting any, any kind of issues with the hair as well. Number three is no surprise, you've probably heard me talk about it in quite a few of these videos, and that's uh, Elixir Oil Team, the Quill Original. So that just means the original oil. Um, you know, I get also asked all the time, what's your favourite product? And, um, and you know, it, it could be, um, for me, it's it's probably Genesis at the moment because um, I've, yeah, I've suffered with hair fall for a very long time and it's phenomenal, especially to concentrate. That's a personal product. In salon, it will always, always, always be Elixir Oil Team. And there's a lot of reasons for that. I love it because of the lightweight uh, effects of the oil which means I can use it on many, many clients, which is why it's number three, uh, you know, within our family, within our ranges, because it can be used by so many people. The benefits of an oil are kind of, are kind of endless. And, and this is what we kind of need to people to really understand, especially at the moment. I know you're probably sick of hearing me talk about central heating. It's not the world's greatest enemy, but actually, to the hair and the skin, it really is. The whole purpose of central heating is to take all the moisture out of the air, create this heat, and then push it back into the air. So it's, it's literally taking moisture out of your hair, out of your skin. And then when we all go out at the moment, hopefully we're all managing to get out and, and go for that walk that we're allowed to do. 
Um, then you're going out to the cold, and you're coming back to the heat, out to the cold and back to the heat. And before you know it, your hair actually starts to feel quite brittle, quite dry, dehydrated, maybe frizzy, fluffy, all those things you associate with dehydration. Um, Elixir Artemis is a remarkable. I love it because it can be used university with, universally with any Kerastase product. It just works across the board. It's got an amazing oil called marula oil. So marula oil is super, super lightweight. And because the molecule is so tiny, it's able to penetrate really far into the fibres of the hair. You've also got camellia oil in there, which is again another super lightweight oil. It's really about the, the, the hydration and the shine. Um, and you've got a few others oil in, oil, oils in there. So they're going to they're treat the de dehydration, they're going to treat dryness, they're going to treat shine. It's going to give you a bit of surface repair. And it's going to give you incredible flexibility to the hair when you come to style it. I think that's really key. What Elixir is, is it is able to penetrate into the fibres. So it's not just sitting on the exterior like some oils that are fabulous on the cuticle, they're fabulous on the outside of your hair, your hair combs through like a dream. But actually, they're not really doing anything too much internally. Elixir is able to work internal and external. So the more you use it, the better your hair will get. It's as simple as that. It also has the amazing 230 degrees heat protection. So it's really one of our highest heat protection products. I love it because you can use it in so many different ways. So one of my favourite ways to use, it, especially I think at the moment, it's great for everybody to really be able to do this, um, is something called a pre-cleanse, which still sounds quite alien to people. It sounds quite unusual. Um, but what I would tend to do is before I know um, I'm going to cleanse my hair, um, or, or yeah, anybody watching, you're going to cleanse your hair, or you're talking to clients when you reopen, or you're talking to clients on Instagram, um, um, your messenger, whatever. What I would tend to do is just apply uh, a pump of elixir, walk through your section, almost randomly section your hair into like a hot cross bun to a, to a full section, and just work it through. Do the same on every section, and then maybe just twist your hair very gently and just leave it. You can leave it for as little as five minutes, but you can leave it for as long as you like. And then all you do is then go and wet your hair down and cleanse your hair like normal. Remember what I said, elixir doesn't just work on the external, it works on the internal fibres. So your hair's now had a really amazing treatment. You then cleanse your hair, um, you know, put the, you know, put the band on, your cuticle opens up, the, the, the oil is actually able to go even further at this point. So it's now working kind of really internal in the fibres. You cleanse the hair, repeat the cleanse, and then you, um, yeah, you treat your hair with whatever you're treating, mask, fondant, whatever. Um, come back and then really apply the Elixir Ultime before you, um, before you blow dry. So that's kind of sealing in the work. What an oil does is putting it on before you blow dry, is sealing what you've just done. So it helps the hair protect and stop, oh, 